Today's trapping tip, how to make a T-bone. Hey, how's everybody doing? Welcome back to another trapping tip. Uh, today's trip is brought to you by this juniper tree right here. It's got some age to it. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to do John Graham's uh, T-bone. I learned this set from a book I read of his uh, quite a few years ago. This is my number one set that I do right here for predators. It works good for uh, uh, coyotes and bobcats. Uh, a little disclaimer, I am out in the west and I am in cow country right here. So there's lots of cows around here and lots of uh, old dead bone piles and that kind of stuff. So seeing this bone is not uh, anything out of the ordinary for them. They chew on them when they're pups all the way up through. So anyways, with that being said, I'm gonna set the camera up and get you going on this T-bone set. So I saved you the trouble of having to watch me uh, chip out this trap bed. I got my Duke number two offset jaw. Get her in here, get some antifreeze in the bottom. Then I'm going to go ahead and do the trail coming through just so it looks a little more natural. Take my trap, I got a bucket of dry dirt right here. I'll go ahead and get the trap bedded. This set works great for all kinds of animals, but uh, I really use it a lot for my coyotes and bobcats. So that is a well bedded trap. I know where my pan is, so then from there I know where I want to put that bone. Just right at the edge of my trap. I'm just giving myself a little bit of a hole I take the T-bone from the back, it's a, it's a vertebrae out of the, the, this one happens to be a cow, and just like that, just like that. So then I'm going to put a couple of quick little blockers in here just to help them step where I want to step, and that's the entire set. Got a little bit of Coyote smell here, I'm going to put on here just very little. About like that, right in the bone hole. Put a piece of wool there if you'd like. Give it a little shot of urine. And that is the set. I'm going to blend it in a tiny bit here, but that is the set. Grab me something for a lure holder over here. A little bit of urine on that side. A little bit of urine on this side gets them really working the set. So the idea is uh, this is just a bone that they're going to want to come mess with. They're going to walk through the set. My pan's right there. It's a super quick and easy set, especially for frozen ground. You don't have to worry about getting a hole knocked in or anything like that. So I hope you guys enjoy today's trapping tip. Just out here rolling around on the coyote trap line. Uh, what did we end up with? Four so far this morning. Brings our total up to uh, 71. So make this set right here. It works excellent for coyotes and excellent for bobcats. Thanks for watching.